Now we're going to go over one-handed mode um, using the Gboard keyboard. And you can do this anywhere you pull up the keyboard throughout your phone. So there is two ways to enter a one-handed mode. We'll go over both of them and then how to use one-handed mode. So the first way to get to it is if you just tap and hold on the comma key here in the bottom left, you'll see you can either select settings or this little thing that looks like a hand holding a phone. You want to go ahead and click this hand holding the phone option. And this brings you into one handed mode. You can see it moves the keyboard kind of over to one side and shrinks it down. And you can start typing on it or you can actually swipe to text on it as well. You can also see on the right here you have a few options. If you want it to be on the right side of the phone instead of the left side of the phone here, you can go ahead and tap on this arrow here and that'll move it to the other side of the phone and you can now use it with your right hand easier. If you want it to go back to full screen, you go ahead and just tap on this little box with the arrows here and now we're back to the normal keyboard. If you want to go ahead and um, access it the other way, you can just go ahead and tap on the arrow here and you'll see I get a bunch of different options here at the top like stickers and gifts and things like that. But if I want to get to one handed mode, I can go ahead and tap on the three dots here and you see I have a bunch more options here and you can see one handed mode is an option down here and I can go ahead and tap on that. But if I want it to be one of the main options here at the top instead of say gifts, I can actually tap and hold on it and move it to the top here. So you can organize this however you want. But now if I just go ahead and click on the one handed mode option, you'll see I'm back to the one handed mode option here. And again, now since I've moved it, it'll always be right there. So those are the two ways to get to it and kind of how to use it. And then the last thing is this box with the arrow down here. This kind of makes it so you can adjust the size and things like that and kind of move it over. And then whenever you're ready, you just hit the check mark. So you can see I've even moved it up higher on the phone than it was before. I can move it lower um, and kind of adjust it that way if I want to. So that's how you use one-handed mode um, on the Gboard keyboard. Hopefully that helps.